Remember, no gi. A lot of no gi is uh, drop from body. A lot of no gi is speed and strength. It compensates for a lot of technique. Okay. So, as opposed to gi, where there's friction and so forth. Okay. I need to get his posture broken, and I need to get an angle. Okay. So I can go here and get here. Okay. This arm right here, he doesn't like it to be compromised. Oftentimes, he'll start pulling you back through here. Yes, I'm gonna push it across and sit up right here, okay? What I like to do is I like to first hug under the armpit. If I hug the head and I don't have the arm, I don't have as much control. My objective is to keep him from pulling his right arm back okay, with my chest, okay? Because from here, it's already, I can turn it back. But my free hand and I'm on my elbow. Sometimes you go up on your hand. But I'm on my elbow. So I grab his hand right here. Two places I'm going to feed it. I can feed it under his armpit right here. You got it. Two things I can do. When you feed it under the armpit, I can take his back just by turning it because it's very difficult for me to get it out. I'm holding his wrist like so, just so that with the thumb, so he doesn't pull the palm out. You got it. Sometimes they push back into you and try to posture up to get the arm across. Dive underneath to hook that leg. And I'm gonna get that angle here, hold him up, and get right here. Okay? From here, I have a good control because this arm is out. This arm, I can feed it here. And now you can have another back to four arms or whatever, maybe. Okay? Sometimes you feed it under the armpit, sometimes you feed it around their neck. What do you do? And it worked three times. Here, here he starts kind of pulling it out. I'm kind of pressuring him here, right here. Okay. First thing I hook is here because it keeps my chest connected. But he brings his elbow back, so I grab here and I grab here and I pull it really tight. Okay. Here, get a wide over so you're not really dead. Look, and I dive underneath him. Okay. This elbow has to stay tight. Okay. And I'm rolling this wrist here. We're here. Oh, sorry, you okay? And then, you rest. Good. Careful with the fingers. Good. Go right into the mat. Professor, when you roll over, how do you stop from landing on the In order for me to get up, I gotta get this leg out of the way. I'm here. He's riding on my right leg. So he's out. I'm gonna pull it through here. Okay. If I don't, I'm never gonna be able to get up. To get up, That leg. I gotta pull him up. Make a fist of wood. Right here. You gently sit him down and keep this twisting arm control figure four seatbelt. If you want to feed the seatbelt, enough to push this out, feed this in the knee. And then you take the back, give me a little squeeze. have them on your leg so that you can basically swing this out like a pendulum. This out.